So I'm isolating myself for two months and today's day one and it's not too bad. I'm doing great. Day two, I'm doing fine. I'm keeping in contact with people on Snap and I'm honestly not worried about this whole thing. I think I can do it. Day five, it's almost been a week. Um, I'm kind of getting bored, but I'm still keeping in contact with people and I think I'm gonna be okay. I still got about 55 more days left. All right, it's been two weeks and my Wi-Fi broke. So I can't talk to anyone at the moment and I'm kind of scared for the next like six weeks to come. It's week three. I haven't talked to people for 21 days and I think I'm going insane. <laughs> week four, I'm halfway through. I didn't get any sleep for the past seven days. I'm not sure what to do anymore. I think it's week five. I'm kind of losing track. I, my Wi-Fi still hasn't been fixed and I haven't talked to people for 35 days. Week six, I've spent a thousand and eight hours in isolation. This is brutal. I am at the worst stage in this whole process, I think, because I've been able to get all the way up to week six, but there's still about two more weeks after this. It's not going too well. It's week seven, and I only have one week after this. I'm almost done. It's week eight, and I'm almost done. I have one more week left. I haven't seen people for eight weeks, and my Wi-Fi hasn't worked for like six weeks, and I haven't talked. It's, it's insane. This is gonna be crazy. One more week. I'm done. I went in isolation for eight weeks and I think that's enough to convince you that I could be an astronaut because that's pretty impressive. Uh, I can hold my breath too for three minutes and I don't have very good balance but I'm good at other things like isolating myself apparently. So yeah, thank you, bye.